All right, they're the stars of A&E's number one rated show. And Don Dotson has mastered the art of auctioning. You could say that again. Just take a look at how he negotiates. Dan's a real slick negotiator. I've got to be careful because it's real easy for me to lose profit at this point in the game. You know, I came in here with a, a telephone expectation of 5,000, so we're a little ways away between 5,000 and 1,000. So this is a really good item. How about 1,200? Let's get a little bit more serious, Dan, if you think it's really something that you want. I, I'd go 2,500 bucks on it. Wow, uh, Storage Wars stars uh, Dan and Laura Dotson, and they are here right now sitting on our couch. Welcome to both of you. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, for having us. You actually <laughs> met at an auction, correct? Yes, yes. I got that auction fever, and I couldn't leave until I had the auctioneer. So, and, so. And, you, and you had him 16 <laughs> yeah. years ago. 16 yes. years ago. I met her three times, one time a year for three years in a row, and I'm so tenacious. The third year, I just I said, man, if you weren't attached, I'd snatch you up. And she said, here's my number, and she never left. Oh, yeah. Right. There was Here's magic. Her. And there you yeah. go. And, and he, there you go. And he closed you so quick, you didn't even know if you were engaged or you <laughs> bought a new car. That's true. Uh, yeah. All right, so, uh, Dan, you, and you've been an auctioneer your whole life. Even as a little kid, you had that. Yeah. Give me some of the cadence. All yes. right, well, I've got 25, I've got 35, I've got 25 here, 35 there, 45, yeah. I've got 45 right there, I've got 55, I've got 55, so we're going once, twice, got to go guess what, and I well, sold that your way for $45 right there. Uh, you just bought Joel off for that. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's a, it. a bargain. And don't forget to pay the lady. <laughs> right, thank you very much. All right, so, Laura, tell me about Storage yes. Wars. You'll get this thing, and it's yes. like, what's behind that door? You don't know what's in it, correct? No, and that is the excitement of it, and I think that's why everybody is tunes in you know, week after week and wants to know what's going on. You can see what's in the first half yeah. of it, but you might not be able to see what's in the second exactly. half. Exactly. So you have to There's guess skill what involved. you don't see by what it, well, yes. How do you see skill? Because I know yeah. one time you said it was, it was lucky. Mm -hmm. You got $500,000 in little pirate's gold. And yeah, it actually yeah. took three people to take the tote from the unit and put it in the truck. And, you never know. But you, you didn't see that there. You just yeah. saw totes. You just saw just blue rubber made totes. Tote. It could have been full of nothing. But right. It was you couldn't something. smell it, you couldn't see it. So well, sometimes it's a big guess. Remember Geraldo Rivera's vault? Yes. Al Capone's vault. Yes. Right. Up, nothing, yes. in it. <laughs> nothing in it. Why does that not happen to you or oh, does my it? Gosh. Well, we always have something yeah. in it. And yeah. it's just uh, up to the buyer to see if it's good or if it's bad. Is it quality? Did the people have pride and ownership? Did they, did they, did they love and pay good money for what mm -hmm. was in there? Or, yeah. or is it old stained mattresses? And uh, that, that's, a, that's a problem. But what do they right. give you in terms of background? Right. Uh, you mean for the unit? So you see the storage unit. Yes. So where yeah. do they tell you? Uh, what do they tell you about it makes you'll, you want to get involved? Okay, you'll have an idea of um, if you're a smart buyer, you will ask the managers or the auctioneers, how long has that unit been here? How long has it been in debt? And they've been locked out of it. Once that unit opens up, you can look. Is there dust on those boxes? Nobody's been in here to retrieve anything good. How does it smell? Is everything sealed? Is there footprints in and out of that unit if there's dust? And, and we say five minutes, yeah. but you can have all the time you need. You right. know, as soon as you've looked at the front of that and everybody's done, then we go ahead and sell it for cash. Who's ever got the most money can buy it and haul it away. All right, so... Uh, so, Dan, uh, some advice you can give people in life, whether they want to go buy a used car or, or mm -hmm. bid on a house. What, Auction what industry is, is a wonderful way to buy stuff. And, you know, you can buy real estate or cars mm -hmm. or anything at auction. And if you want something, you should know what you're wanting to pay for. You should be prepared there with the cash. And you should have yes. a way to get rid of it and to get it, uh, get it moved out. And here yeah. you go. How to succeed in auction. Come prepared. Bring yeah. a great source and have a way to get things sold. Now, Absolutely. Exactly right. And here's the other thing, Laura, and I know you yes. want to hear this. Yes. Uh, what if somebody has something at home and thinks, you know, I could probably get some money for this. Yeah, you know what? Don't be afraid to call your auctioneer, and we will come appraise that for you. And if you've got more items, we'll let you know. And you want a big auction, we will set it up. Craigslist, eBay, yes. it's very easy to do completed yeah. listings and find out what things are worth. So if you have stuff around your house and you don't yeah. know what it's worth, you should just research it. And, yes. and the, internet makes, the internet makes it super simple. You ever buy anything that. new? Oh, boy, I have to really twist his arm. I have to take him to show him the most expensive thing. So finally, I'll work my way down. Bain he goes, switch. it'll come up That's in a unit, he says. <laughs> so. and, and almost everything's negotiable in life. <laughs> exactly. Season three starts on oh, June man. 5th. And yes. what time? Yes, 10, 9 Central, Tuesday nights. Can't wait. We're going to be on explosive. Hot in Cleveland on TV yeah. Land on uh, May 16th at 10 o'clock. Uh, watch Betty White. Uh, she's all hands. She's yeah. tough. She's uh, 90 years old. She was Everybody's got the fever. Right, thank you I'd like much. to see you out there. Um, I don't, they wouldn't give me the time off the couch. Dan and Laura Dotson, congratulations on your success. Thanks Thank so much you. on You're your awesome. career Thank and your you. marriage. Oh, Thank you, you know Thank it, you so baby. All right. Thank you.